the heavens opened on Sunday morning as former Prime Minister Lee Kuan Yew made his final journey through Singapore. The gun carriage carrying the body of Mr Lee started from Parliament House and made its way through various landmarks. It was at the old Parliament House where Mr Lee, then 35 years old, delivered his first speech as Singapore's Prime Minister. It was also here where Singapore was shaped through fierce debates and powerful speeches. Thank you, Mr. Lee! Braving the rain, the crowd looks on as four 25-pounder ceremonial guns fire a 21-gun salute. In 1959, the crowd at the Padang were equally captivated as Mr. Lee and his new team held a rally when Singapore achieved self-government. That day, the party's rallying cry roared in front of the Supreme Court. The carriage then passes through the Tanjung Paga district, where Mr. Lee has been a member of parliament since 1955. Today marks his final journey through the constituency. There, the pinnacle at Duxton stands, a symbol of the success of Singapore's housing policy. And as the cottage passes through Bukit Merah and Queenstown, two of Singapore's oldest housing estates, people from all walks of life came out to say their last goodbye. <laughs> Education is one of the cornerstones of our society, and Mr Lee made it his mission to build a meritocratic nation. It is fitting then that Mr. Lee's state funeral is held within the National University of Singapore, where the gun carriage carrying his body finally comes to rest. Wow.